All right, so here we are, somewhere between two and three. Hi. Tony is lying down on his pack because it's heavy. <laughs> Came from well, wherever those tents are, even further because we're lucky. Our camp is at the beginning of Camp Two. Yeah, someone's clearing their throat. It sounds gross. Um, it's somewhere at the beginning of Camp Two, so just at the start of this base. To see people laboring over. It took us four hours in the hot sun. Oh, man, it did not take us four hours last time. I think it took us two hours. It's really cool to see this. those clouds were not there <clears throat> maybe 30 minutes ago. It's really neat to watch physics at play live. Sun's out, heating up the air. The air rises, cools down, turns into clouds, boom. That's what you have. It's just amazing. Don't tell me that's where those guys were videoing. And that's as far, like, don't tell me that, please. Oh, look at that. What a catch on that avalanche just before camp, too. Good reason our camp is not there. Yeah, no kidding. It's right next to our camp. Eh, bhaiya. Bhaiya. Hamare camp ke ek dam bagal mein. Safe, magar phir bhi. Yeah, I was very lucky. It's fascinating. For those of you watching the video, it's really neat to imagine these dark colored rocks heating up in the sun and slowly loosening up the glacier. And then you have fancy, fancy falls like that. And actually, we get a lot of waterfall by our camps. Hey, boy, get up! It's okay, they're not going anywhere. Jumar laga. Jumar laga. Rock laga. Oh no. That's horrible. Two people got hit by a rock from above. <clears throat> Another good reason not to go up while others are heading up. Or as we say, amateurs at 12 o'clock, eh? Is that our group? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Meanwhile, I hope they're okay. I can't run that fast up there right now. Huh? Oh no. Choriko. For those of you who are not understanding this, there's a, a lady that's gotten injured by a rock fall coming off this hockey stick gully, as I call it, on Lotse face. I don't know what else to call it. Man, I feel bad for her. She must be so, so sore. No. She's getting up, though. Huh? Ryogi. Upper jari or niche? Pata nahi. Dekha do aadmi ko laga. Yeah, fascinating. Two people. Problem is, there are two ropes there, and you can distinctly see them. However, <coughs> the people descending rapidly want to come down the ascending rope instead of the descending rope. And as they come down in a hurry, they start kicking stuff down. And it, even a little baseball size rock or ice will, without your helmet, will kill you. An oxygen bottle. That's true. I actually landed somewhere right around here. Off the face. <coughs> See, that's why I call it the hockey stick gully. Kind of has a angle to it of a hockey stick. And 
when that oxygen cylinder fell, it just fell straight. It was amazing. Hey. Teen long kalaga. Do ko nahi teen kalaga. Do kalaga. Do kalaga. Do niche wale ek neele. Hai na? Do neele wale. You got dead on the spot. Oh really? Yeah. No That's way. What I heard. Yeah. DOA. I'm too I'm too tired to run over there. I can't help. Now the body tired. Oh my god. Yeah, DOA. There's a dead body. Yes, yeah, sir. That's what happens when you don't wear a helmet here and when people of arm above are doing dumb things. Upar se bahut girta hai yahan. Kam hai. Pichle saal bahut. Wow. He's saying it was a lot worse last year. Abhi radio pe aaya ke mar gayi. Abhi suna. अभी सुना रेडियो पे नहीं यहीं से यहीं यहीं लगा है मालूम है मगर कहाँ है नीचे होगी हाँ यही इसी बर्फ के पीछे the strength of the mountain हाँ ओ यहाँ तो ऑक्सीजन सिलेंडर तो यहाँ तक आया है ना कम से कम तो हम लोग यहाँ से हिल सकते हैं I'm wondering if we should go. I mean, this is not humane. I have no idea who it is. जाना चाहिए भाई, भैया. जाना चाहिए ना हाँ अगर मदद चाहिए किसी को बैग छोड़ के यहीं वी शुड गो अरे हम शट मिस ऑफ